Hi, this is Lorenzo, Audison Pro Engineer, and I'm here live from the Vegas Show 2017 to show you more about the Audison APM. Have you watched my videos last year? The Audison APM is the first in-car acoustic performance measurement tool, a separate part that can be used only with Audison B2. This unique and sophisticated technology allows the objective evaluation of in-car sound quality one that is not influenced by music genre and instead one that is based on human auditory perception and one that is able to highlight the system performance even when pushed to the limit. So, are you looking for a test your system sound performance and you don't know how to do? Follow me and I will show you today. The beat tune is plugged into the Beat 1 HD as well as my laptop PC. And here we have the dummy head featuring two microphones in the ears ready for the sound stage test. And the single TMD microphone which is used for the distortion test. The test tracks for the APM have been stored into the BeatPlay's internal hard drive. Everything is ready. Let's start by launching the newest Beatin software in APM mode. The software features two modes for the measurement. Free mode, FSA and TMD tests can be performed without any limitation. The best way for experts who want to make their set of analysis as well as tests for the OEM system performance. Competition mode, three SPL categories and a wiser analysis ensure the same conditions for anyone who wants to compete, compare and share the APM result in our online world network. And now I'm going to try competition mode at 90dB. Before I start, don't forget to fill in all the fields above. FSA is the first test. It requires to connect the dummy head and place it in the driving position. No matter where you drive, the software will automatically detect the head position. To proceed, you have to adjust the system volume to reach 80 dB using a pink noise track. After that, the analysis starts and the algorithm will be able to locate the virtual sound image generated by the stereophonic configuration as perceived by the human auditory system. TMD is the next test. As done before, we have to place the TMD microphone in the same position and now reach the required 90 dB SPL. The system's linear and non-linear distortions will be highlighted by using a real musical track. A novel and significant approach when the system is pushed close or over its distortion point. job! Here we have the FSA score, elevation and azimuth angles respectively estimate the vertical and horizontal position of the virtual source. TMD score is the result of the non-linear distortion quantification at high, mid and low frequencies, while the linear distortion allows the quantification of the frequency response alteration from the molar target curve measured by three indices. Would you post your result? Click here to join in the online world competition ranking of the Master Sound Quality Race. So guys, hopefully you enjoyed this video. The future is moving toward new exciting innovations. Don't get left behind. As always, stay tuned, stay with Audison Beat Technology.